All right, guys. So I have a unboxing to do, and it is pinball related. Woo. So let's let's get it going. And this, I will say, this give you a clue. This is to pertain to the um, screen and speaker panel that I've been having quite the words in uh, trying to figure out how, how to mount everything and it's like ugh, it's a pain in the ass and I finally did the thing with uh, looking in the manual on how and about what parts I needed and so I I went through the list and of course I didn't need the screen I didn't need like the metal back I didn't need the panel of course because I have that already but yeah went through and got everything that I um, needed that I didn't have all right we have this pinball at the beach February 7th through the 9th, 2025. So that's cool. Pinball at the All right. Okay, so this is, has escaped. It's A22556 06. And I think that's a coil. Hopefully it's in here somewhere. Alright, so we got some tension springs. Uh, usual springs that are uh, in like jet bumpers and, and stuff like that. And then there's something in here. This I think I'm going to use as a template to uh, do the the kind of an inward scoop kind of U shape on the. Uh, but I also might use this just to. I don't know, um, but yeah, I probably will use it as a template to for that sort of thing. All right, we have, ah, uh, th this is actual metal. I thought it was plastic, but it's actual metal. It's an AC line cord cover. So I'm going to use that to cover the uh, hole. All right, we have this two stern spike back box lock can and cams. I'm basically right now using this to uh, keep the plastic plexi in place. Uh, don't have the head at all done at all. All right, we have ball popper cap gleams. Got a couple of those. All right, another layer of stuff. Ah, uh, yes, I uh, got some 24 nuts, uh, nut 6 32nd uh, stock nut purple, anodized. And sorry about that, it was kind of off camera there. Okay, and we got a Trying plunger, but I got it for the ball, the up, up kicker, up kicker, uh, for the ball to eject the ball into the shooter lane. And uh, coil mounting bracket, 
Again, this is for the ball trough area. Because I was like, hmm, I have the ball trough, but then I remembered I needed the uh, rest of this ball trough stuff. So this is another ball trough uh, assembly. And then I got these two things that are I may I think I do need, but I got them just in case. And this looks like a one of the smaller in stop uh, posts. And then this is to hold in the coil with the sleeve and stuff. Uh, yes, and I bought four new leg bolt plates because um, my police force the left leg is the top bolt doesn't uh, it doesn't tighten down so I got four new plates and I think yeah I got more I got new bolts as well even though I, I probably should have got the gold ones because I do like that I do like the gold on on the uh, police force so I might get those at some point but yeah I got eight new leg bolts as well right now I do have the police force on its legs I just uh, have that um, the new um, well it's a motorcycle thing but I use it to um, lift up the uh, pinball machine to get the legs off so I'm I have it just touching the bottom so um, it's more stable and it and if the let so that the leg doesn't snap off because that's what I'm uh, most not I don't want it to do that I also did this that at Portland Retro Gaming Expo because I don't want the uh, leg to come off, snap off when somebody's playing it, so. Ah, yes, and here's, here's, I didn't, I wasn't sure which one of the instops to get, so I got both the, the low, uh, post and the higher, like the mid post on there, so I have both to, uh, play with. And then we have a washer washers. I believe this is for the panel. We got 24 of those. And I think these are also for the panel as well. The 12 screw uh, machine screws. A 5 millimeter by 6 millimeter. And then these uh, 5 30 seconds uh, by 3 8 uh, inch Torx. And the last thing in here is a uh, coil. Um, it's a AO 2700-1200. Uh, they didn't have the one for the um, ball kicker. So I got this one that I hope will work. But, but yeah, let's uh, get into it. So it's a really tiny, tiny coil, but I think that's what you want in the ball trough area is a smaller coil, but yeah, um, so, so yeah, this, Basically all this stuff is going to be for the ball, ball kicker 
and I can have up to seven balls in the trough is what it what it's saying, so I could <clears throat> Yeah, so I could have like seven ball multiplayer if I wanted to. So far, I've got like three ball in mind. But uh, we'll see how that goes. So, yeah. Hope you guys are enjoyed enjoyed the uh, uh, this unboxing of even more pinball stuff, and hopefully this is going to be the end because uh, doing this all on my own monies is, is yeah it's getting to very expensive. It's um. If I had to guesstimate, I probably have spent over the years like nine to ten thousand uh, for parts and shit. Um, so yeah, it's quite expensive. Uh, so yeah, anyways. So if you, you like this video, give it a thumbs up or not. And uh, if you haven't yet, uh, hit that subscribe button and uh, see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone